Welcome to Coco Time with Baylor, Noah, and Dalton. Welcome. 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 Also starring our two special guest creepers, Peyton and Colby. Yeah, that's me. A chubby little snowman had a carrot nose. Along came a bunny. What do you suppose? That hungry little bunny, looking for some lunch, grabbed that snowman's nose. Nibble, nibble, crunch. I made myself a snowball, as perfect as could be. I thought I'd keep it as a pet and let it sleep with me. I made it some pajamas and a pillow for its head. Then last night it ran away, but first it went to bed. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only a hippopotamus will do. I don't want a doll, no dinky tinker toys. I want a hippopotamus to play with and enjoy. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. I don't think Santa Claus will mind. Do you guys? No. No, not at all. He won't have to use our dirty old chimney. He can just come to the front door. That's the easy thing to do. Okay. As you can see me now on Christmas morning, creeping down the stairs. Oh joy, what a surprise when I open up my eyes and see my hippo hero standing there. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only hippopotamus will do. No crocodiles, no rhinoceroses. I only like hippopotamuses. And hippopotamuses like me too. Mom says the hippo would eat me up, but the teacher says the hippos are vegetarian. There's a lot of room for him in our two-car garage. I can feed him there, wash him there, and give him a massage. I can see me now on Christmas morning, creeping down the stairs. A joy with a surprise when I open up my eyes to see my hippo hero standing there. I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Only hippopotamus will do. No crocodiles, no rhinoceroses. I only want hippopotamuses. And hippopotamuses want me too.